we've kind of seen this team have players that have been rumored to be in the trade deadline in the past, and you've held on to them for multitudes of reasonings, whether that's you hope that their value will go up over time, um, or it, as you mentioned, it's just not the right move at the time. But with DeJounte, I'm curious, how do you guys find that balance of maybe hoping that you know, his value could go up over time or he fits in the long-term plan. How do you, how do you balance those two things? Um, Another good question. I, I'm less interested in maximizing just a player's value in order to make a move for a different player. Like that is a part of any sports business. And I, and I certainly understand that, but that's also kind of not totally in your control, right? Like if a player goes down on injury, something significant, you know, like what does that do do for a player's value? Like that's, that to me um, is not as important as, okay, placing a value on going to a DeJounte or a Jalen or a Trey Young and saying, hey, here are the areas in which we can continuously improve upon. Value and all that stuff, that'll take care of itself. What comes before that is like, well, what are you doing to enhance value or what are you not doing to not enhance your value um but we're more interested in like the process the process of daily habits which we've been you know we've talked before on this very thing like to me having that as a huge focal point results will take care of themselves in that and maybe not you may not see it right away but again the trajectory over a long haul i'm willing to bet that we would be net positive and we would see a more sustainable model of uh, of that particular thing. And um, I'm more interested in that than I am in just the immediate, like quick, let's just grab for anything talent wise and try to make a play. You know, like you're gonna need talent in this, in this league. I'm fully aware of that. Um, but at the same time, growing from within is really important because that gives us, that gives us, that just gives us a great way. And, um, you know, as you look over, in time, when you look at across sports at, at great organizations, they grow from within. And there's a particular DNA structure that they have for that. And that I, I am much more interested in than, than short-term things. But that requires patience. It really does. Um, I'm right there with you. Sometimes I walk in, I'm like, wish we were further than we are. But you know what? We've made the guardrails. Um, we have everyone that's bought in. And sometimes like we'll get to a point where, yeah, you got to make changes. Um, but again, wasn't the time to do it this at this point.